One of Central Florida's newest attractions that will get you face to face with animals like sloths, monkeys and sharks, but it's not a zoo. News 6 anchor and insider guide Crystal Moyer shows us where visitors can get a closer look at some unique animals all in the name of science. Honestly, it's unreal. I've never seen anything like it. The fact the sloth is really trying to reach out and grab me. John Gow and his son Shelby are visiting the Orlando Science Center's newest attraction, Life. The exhibit highlighting three separate environments, the swamp, the ocean, and the rainforest, where animals like the sun conures, tortoises, and golden-headed lion tamarins are free to roam. We have Carmen that's on the left, Tom on the right. Every exhibit that you will find here is a mixed species exhibit, so you'll see that we have Izzy, our Hoffman's two-toed sloth, that is moving towards our tamarins right now. The Orlando Science Center wanted the animals to tell the stories and educate visitors. Because there are so many species that have conservation concerns, their numbers are dwindling out in the wild, and by having these animals here, we're allowing them to be ambassadors for those animals, for their wild counterparts so that you can know what their stories are and what we can do to contribute to making things better for them. And here at Life, the habitats are maintained to feel like how they would in the wild. For example, here in the rainforest area, it's warm and it's humid. The swamp features alligators and turtles. But I love that they get to see a uh, Florida ecosystem as well, our local you know, flora and fauna. It's so hands-on. The focus is really on experiencing and touching and doing rather than just reading exhibits. And kids and adults can't help but put their faces against the glass of the ocean tank with colorful coral, fish, and sharks. It's one of Dr. Sarah Layton's favorite areas. Well, I'm a scuba diver and I'm a shark diver. People ask me, don't sharks scare you? And I say, no. Dr. Layton is the presenting sponsor for life, making the highest individual contribution to the $13.5 million project about a decade in the making. Finally seeing plans come to, well, literally life, has Dr. Layton feeling overwhelmed, emotional. Even with the new exhibit, parents like Gao are feeling the nostalgia of visiting the Orlando Science Center. I started coming to the Orlando Science Center when I was probably his age on field trips and kindergarten and whatnot. So to be able to carry on the experience and see all the different paths and stages it's taken has been amazing. We posted more details on life at clickorlando.com slash insider. While you're there, you can enter to win four tickets to the Orlando Science Center to check out the new attraction for yourself. Crystal Moyer, Getting Results, New 6.